Hello viewers, welcome to Elimu TV, your station where you watch and learn. I'm your tutor, Mr. Mwangi, taking you through uh, chemistry form 3, organic chemistry. This is lesson number 8. Please uh, do follow and pay attention. What are the goals of this lesson? By the end of this lesson, you'll be able to state the first six members of alkynes and you'll be able to draw and name the six members. So alkynes, we have introduced ourselves previously to organic chemistry, where we talked about hydrocarbons, compounds made up of carbon and hydrogen only. But the bond between carbon atoms in alkenes is not a single bond, not a, not a double bond. Alkynes have a triple bond, and the structure can be illustrated as shown in the diagram. Then alkynes contain a triple bond, which gives us the functional group. The first member, uh, the members of this uh, group include ethane gas, having two carbon atoms with triple bond between them. And since each carbon has three bonds already co bonded covariantly to the next carbon bond, therefore we only have one atom, uh, one bond left open where hydrogen now forms a covariant bond. Member number three, we have prop one in, and prop one in is our member number two, having three carbon atoms and the triple bond along that chain. Member number three is butane, butane. Remember the triple bond can be along each of these carbons, it can be in carbon number one or carbon number two, and hence we can have different uh, names of referring to position of the triple bond. So members of this group also are more. We have pent 2 ion. We also have hex 3 ion. That is we have uh, three, we have six carbon atoms in which carbon number three we have a triple bond. And we also have hept 1 in having the condensed uh, structural formula as the one that we have illustrated in this example. So the general formula of alkynes include CN, H2N, minus 2. N represents the number of carbon atoms in the structure. So we can have one carbon atom, we can have two carbon atoms within the structure, and we can have even three. So the easiest way to get in the molecular formula of this compound is by substituting N with the number of carbon atoms along that chain. So did we get to understand the goals of this lesson? Can we be able to name the members of alkynes? Can we be able to generate uh, any formula of this compound? So we can do so by simply answering the following questions. Number one, draw and name the eighth member of alkynes. Remember, just follow the general uh, rule, uh, the general molecular formula. We can get any member. We can get member number 10, 20, 30 by simply following that rule. Question number two, let's try to define the term isomerism. And we can as well as illustrate the types of isomers that are exhibited by alkynes. Question number three, draw and name all the possible isomers of pentane. That is a carbon, uh, a hydrocarbon with triple bonds in which we have five carbons and uh, each carbon atom must be uh, bonded with all the four bonds uh, occupied. So you can refer this to students chemistry book three as well as give us a text through the number on your screen. You can as well as send or uh, visit us at, uh, at our YouTube channel at Arimu TV or Facebook page at Arimu TV or give us a tweet at Arimu TV underscore KE. So once again, your tutor, Mr. Mongi Francis, pay attention for more lessons to come.